What's up y'all, it's Sherry from Global Kingdom Network. How are you? I'm out and I just wanted to come on and hop on and do a video outside. It's so nice, it like feels so good after the heat, it rained. So listen, I wanna come on and I wanna talk to you about love versus lust. I wanna talk to you about love versus lust. I wanna talk about how you know the difference. I wanna talk about how you know that someone is the one. Can you tell how someone is the one? Yeah, you can. Well, how is that? How is that? Well, I'm going to tell you how that is. God will put a pure love in your heart, in your heart, in your mind for someone. Okay? Someone, someplace, something. That's how you know. You ever like um, see an animal and you get an animal um, from the pet shop and you're like, oh, I love it. I love them. There's a love in there in your heart for it, right? So that's kind of like the beginning stages, right? Oh, you fall in love with the dog, but then you can have the dog, and the dog can, can be can be a complete disaster. He can pee all over the floor. He can chew your wires, chew up your furniture, whatever you know. So that's like you reacting emotionally to oh I love them I love them well do you do you know you don't know when you're picking an animal what you're getting just like when you adopt kids you know you don't know you don't know what you know your kids are gonna are gonna do to you but when God puts a love in your heart there's a knowing See, that's the difference. With lust, there's not a knowing. With lust, there's uncertainty. With lust, there's depression comes, anxiety comes, uh, those feelings inside where you're always worried, you're in fear, you don't know if they're cheating, you don't know where they are, you don't know, you know, that's not love, that's lust. That's uncertainty. That is picking the wrong person. But when you know that you know, this is how you know. When you feel God's love, you know it's Him. If you have an intimate relationship with God, you feel Him. You know Him. It's not about emotion. You know who that person is. You feel Him. You feel me? Like when I always say, you feel me? You feel Him. You know Him. You feel His presence. You have peace. You have certainty. You have joy, even in the midst of troubles, even in the midst of whatever trial you're going through. There's a knowing, there's a certainty. And that's how you know the person is the one. They won't rush. It's not about rushing. It's not about having sex before marriage. It's not about you pushing your agenda on somebody else. It's not about feeling those crazy feelings that make you emotional wreck. It's about knowing that you know. God, when God puts a love in your heart, when you, you're attracted to somebody and you start feeling like you might like somebody, when God will put that love in your heart, it's a special love. It's his love putting you in, in the heart, uh, that love in your heart for that person only. Your eyes won't look anywhere else. If their eyes are looking elsewhere, if you have to compete with their love, if you have to compete for their love, then it's not, it's not God. Because God will put that same love in your heart that gives you peace, that gives you the stability to wait. God doesn't operate in instability, okay? Uh, he'll put that same love in that other person's heart who you're attracted to, and they will draw near to you. They will draw near to you. They will not operate in fear. They will not act, operate shady. Uh, playboyish promiscuous they will have eyes only for you so that's how you know take a check take an inventory of the person that you like take inventory of how you're feeling take inventory of how that person makes you feel every day are you worried are you concerned all the time do you not trust them that's not God. That's not the pure love of God. The pure love of God will be put in you and you will be at peace and you will be settled like, okay, something in the spirit, spirit to spirit. It says we will know them by the spirit, spirit to spirit. God will put a supernatural love in your heart for someone, someplace, 
or something. He will. And you will know that it's him. Amen. I love you. Have a great day or night, wherever you are. Shalom.